guys, my mind is blown. I just finished a book that has my mind reeling. Like I finished it this morning and all day long it has been playing over and over and over in my mind. And that to me is the true test of a very good book. Even movies, TV shows, things like that. Anything that keeps your mind working and thinking about it, you know that it has affected you. Whether it's good or bad, it affected you in some way that you will remember it. And for me, that was Bird Box by Josh Mailerman. Damn, this was such a creepy book. But not in the way of like blood, guts, and gore. It was more like the psychological aspect of this book. So first, rewind. Let me tell you what the book is about. It's sort of an apocalyptic style book. It takes place in the mid, early 2000s and we follow Mallory is our main character and she has recently discovered she's pregnant in a world around her that is falling apart. People are killing each other, killing themselves in the most brutal ways. Like their their mind just goes crazy and nobody knows why. And like they're watching all these news reports about what's happening and from what they can gather people see something and then it makes them go mad and it leads to a brutal death so what they've done is her and her sister have cooped themselves inside their house and have boarded the windows put sheets and blankets and cardboard whatever they can find over the windows and if they have to go outside they blindfold themselves and for a time that works but you can only go so long before you get cabin fever and you start your mind starts playing tricks on you anyway and something ends up happening to her sister so Mallory decides that she has to leave where she is and she um, has read somewhere in, in the newspaper there's an ad for someplace safe for her to go so she ventures out into the outside world to get to this place. She discovers these um, people who take her in and lives with them for a time and gives birth there and there's another girl there who is also pregnant and some crazy shit happens while she's given birth and then she ends up having to leave that place and take these two kids out onto this river completely blindfolded. But what's crazy about that whole situation, she has trained these kids for the last four years to have like superhuman hearing. Like they can hear things beyond the house. They can hear where it's coming from, who's making this sound. I mean, she has trained them from birth to wake up with their eyes closed. So this book has, for such a short, book this story grabbed you from the very beginning it doesn't let go you just turn page after page after page you want to find out what the fuck has got these people going crazy but nobody knows what it is you have to figure it out and you you figure it out along with our main character and it is just, oh my god. So I heard about this book from another booktuber. And I need to start taking notes when I get my recommendations. Because I can't remember who it was. But as soon as I watched the video, I went on Amazon and ordered this book straight away. And I'm just now getting to it. And it was phenomenal. I will give this 5 out of 5 stars on Goodreads because... You guys, this book is just so good. I don't even think that you have to be particularly into psychological thrillers to appreciate this book. The writing style, the author 
just has a way of bringing the characters to life and making you care so much about what happens to her. I just, I don't, I don't even know what to say. I'm, because I think I read it so soon, my mind hasn't had enough time to digest everything about it. But I wanted to get on here and let you know about this book because it's just so good. I, can't, I know I keep repeating myself, but it was just so good. If you get a chance to pick up this book, read it. Let me know what you think. Let me know what your thoughts are because I would love to talk to somebody about it somebody who just loves it as much as even if you didn't love it even if you didn't like it let me know why let me know what your thoughts are on it and um, yeah so that is my review for Bird Box excellent book definitely worth your time worth your money even if you get it from the library I don't care pick it up if you get the opportunity because it is a phenomenal book. I'm gonna look and see what else he has written because now I'm in love with his writing style. I'm dying to see if there's anything else that he has put out or is about to put out or whatever. And if there is, I will let you guys know. No, but until next time, bye guys.